Hi guys, hi ladies, hi gentlemen, hi boys and girls, because there will be boys and children, underage, under, underage smokers watching as well, I'm hoping. So, I wanted to um, not talk with you, but, but I wanted to show you this, this readout that I found online and it's basically titled smoking and smoking and Mo and Mo molecular degeneration that's the title that's basically blind blindness so yeah it's basically blindness blindness from smoking so you can get blindness from smoking basically so it, in the subheading it says pretty much everyone knows that smoking causes lung cancer but not but not many but but not many realize that that smoking also causes blindness so let me just get a time i'm just checking this is recording so So um, so let me just show you the video. So let me just one minute. Let me just show. No, it's not a video. It's just a readout. But it's best best if you hear it from from this website because the words that I pronounce they they pronounce it better than I than I than I can because I these are all like these pronunciations are like like doctors and or or scientific names. Maybe not scientific names, but just doctors names. So oh, yeah, let me just play the video. One minute, one minute. Macular degeneration. Pretty much everyone knows that smoking causes lung cancer, but not many realize that smoking so also we causes... So we start again. Smoking and macular degeneration. Pretty much everyone knows that smoking causes lung cancer, but not many realize that smoking also causes blindness. There is a very strong link between smoking and macular disease. Smokers are up to four times more likely than non-smokers to develop age-related macular degeneration AMD and smokers with a genetic predisposition to AMD are eight times more likely to get the condition. Some research suggests people with certain genes can be 20 times more likely to get macular degeneration if they smoke. Our rage and our genes have a big effect on whether or not we develop AMD but we can't change those. We can change our smoking habits. Smoking is the biggest modifiable risk factor for AMD. By stopping smoking, you will reduce your chance of getting AMD and of your AMD progressing. There is also some evidence that smokers who are being treated for wet macular degeneration do not respond as well to the treatment as non-smokers. Furthermore, Non-smokers who live with smokers are also at increased risk of developing macular degeneration from passive smoking. Why does smoking increase the risk of AMD? One explanation of why we age is the theory of oxidative stress. Sorry. This is when the cells of the body are exposed to certain types of molecules called oxidants. They are unstable molecules and include free radicals. Oxidants are known to damage the structure of cells, which gradually become less able to renew themselves. We can counteract the effect of oxidants to an extent by ensuring our diet is rich in antioxidants, usually the vitamins and minerals found in fruit and vegetables. Cigarette smoke contains 4,500 chemicals, many of which are free radicals. For example, smoke contains arsenic, formaldehyde and ammonia. These chemicals are transported to the delicate tissues of the eye through the bloodstream, where they damage the structure of the cells. Repeatedly exposing delicate retinal cells to these oxidants is effectively fast-forwarding the aging process. 
at the same time as increasing the levels of oxidants in the body. Smoking decreases the levels of antioxidants and so reduces the body's ability to protect itself. Cigarette smoke also reduces the amount of oxygen reaching the choroid. This is a dense network of tiny blood vessels that supply the retina. Smoking also damages blood vessels themselves. For example, the large blood vessels in the heart as well as the tiny ones in the eye. Smoking also increases your overall blood pressure level. High blood pressure is another risk factor for macular degeneration. Research suggests that the dye in cigarettes triggers the formation of deposits in the retina drusen which mark the start of macular degeneration. Some research suggests that smokers have lower levels of the macular pigments lutein and zeaxanthin. These are antioxidant substances in the macula which are thought to protect it from the damaging effects of sunlight. They are obtained from food, mainly green leafy vegetables like kale and spinach. People with low levels of macular pigment are more likely to develop AMD. Quit smoking now. If you need help to stop smoking, please talk to your GP or find out more about quitting smoking via the following link. Help to stop smoking. E-cigarettes. It is best to quit smoking altogether, but if you cannot, even with the support of stop smoking aids, e-cigarettes are probably safer than cigarettes. Further reading. For more information about nutrition and lutein, you can download our leaflet Nutrition and Your Eyes by clicking here. If you would like to learn more about the correlation between smoking and sight loss, these links will take you to some of the research quoted above. Smoking and Treatment for Wet Macular Degeneration Visual Loss Attributable to Smoking Smoke Gets in Your Eyes Cigarette smoke related oxidants and dry AMD. Passive smoking almost doubles risk of degenerative eye disease. Study explains how smoking raises risk of macular degeneration. Risk factors for age related maculopathy are associated with a relative lack of macular pigment. So, that's it, but let me show you the website that where I found it. Sorry, I was trying to I was trying to find you find you the website where I found it, but I'll I'll give you the website link. I'll give you the website link in the dis in the description. So basically, all this all this all this um article was about how how bad the the, the smoking can affect your eyes how how you, how it can make you blind basically and definitely or you 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 heard what it said you heard what it said anyway so I will put the website link in the in the in the description so I will talk to you all soon hope well I'll talk talk with you all soon God bless Take care and peace be with you. And bef just before I go, if you already have this condition or or, or anything like that, just go go to a, go to a friend, a, a Christian friend, and ask for prayer because Jesus heals. God God steals. God heals. Jesus Jesus still heals. So you can you can phone me up asking for prayer for healing or or any healing and just you know just because you got this eye condition you, you know doesn't mean does because you got this eye condition doesn't mean it doesn't mean it doesn't it doesn't mean that it's that it's the end of you you can get healed from this 
but I'll definitely give up smoking. Do your best if you can, please. I'm only saying please for your for your sake and for mine, because passive smoking is not good. Okay, thanks and God bless. Take care.